Hello, Ethical Hackers. Today, I share with you the best hacking books I enjoyed reading while learning so much. I will constantly update the list as I read more, but you already have enough hacking books to get you started in the information security industry. It also contains some advanced hacking books for those who want to level up their hacking skills. Web Hacking 101 – How to Make Money Hacking Ethically This is a hacking book for bug bounty hunters. Peter Yarsky introduces bug bounty hunting to beginners and pragmatically explains the different vulnerabilities. For each one, he gives examples of reports from HackerOne's activity, which is where HackerOne's bug bounty reports get published. At the end of the book, he shares a bug bounty methodology using well-known tools. It is the first hacking book I read when I started doing bug bounty hunting. You can get a free copy when you register an account on HackerOne. You can read it in one day. If you're a beginner in the bug bounty field, give it a try. You won't be disappointed. The basics of hacking and penetration testing. This is the first hacking book I have ever read about penetration testing, and boy was it helpful. If you have limited knowledge and want to kickstart your hacking skills, this is a must read. I had practically zero knowledge of ethical hacking and penetration testing, but this hacking book opened my eyes wide open. It teaches penetration testing as a methodical approach, explaining each step at a time. During each phase, you will learn the different concepts, tools and techniques that every penetration tester uses in real-life engagements. Hacking – The Art of Exploitation, 2nd Edition If you want to learn and practice low-level programming and exploitation of buffer overflow vulnerabilities, this book is for you. I remember tackling the buffer overflow challenges on Root.me, and this book gave me a strong boost. I was able to easily understand how they work, what protections usually mitigate them, and how to bypass those mitigations as well. In fact, it starts easy and covers programming in C and Bash scripting. It explains various communication protocols and how to interact with them. But the meat of the book is buffer overflows. The author has great teaching skills that will make you understand the concepts behind buffer overflow before you know it. It illustrates them with simple examples that you can replicate using the live CD that comes with the book. Ghost in the Wires – My Adventures as the World's Most Wanted Hacker When I barely started exploring the world of hacking, I came across Kevin Mitnick dubbed as the most wanted hacker, and I wanted to know how he earned that fame. So I read this book, which is basically an autobiography. Throughout the thrilling chapters, Kevin Mitnick tries to rehabilitate his image by explaining the details of his hacking journey. They include why and how he hacked many companies, how he has been monitoring the FBI agents who followed him, how he hacked the prison's phone system, and how he has faked his identity many times. It's not a hacking book in the sense that it doesn't teach technical concepts, but it's a great read full of thrilling moments if you want to explore the inner working of a hacker mindset. Plus, the reader will learn why hacking outside the law can be troublesome. The Web Application Hacker's Handbook, 2nd Edition this hacking book is the bible of web application hacking. If you seriously want to learn how to hack web applications, this book is a must. I read it two times and let me tell you that it's so heavy. It presents different angles to attack every web application. Throughout the book, the authors illustrate some real-world examples, present different payloads and explain the hacking concepts in a very detailed way. From application mapping to business logic errors, you will learn it all. I suggest you take the time to read and grasp each chapter. Also, take notes while reading as it would help you remember where each topic is located when you want to revisit it. And trust me, you will.
The Art of Intrusion. This is another hacking book of Kevin Mitnick, where he narrates some mind-blowing hacking stories. If you want to explore how creative hackers can get and how far they can go, then this is a must-read. I read it two times because it was so entertaining, educating, thrilling at the same time. Perhaps the most epic stories I really enjoyed reading were the casino jackpot hack and the stealing of a huge software from outside. Both stories contain so many creative ways of breaking into a system, but I won't spoil it for you. Give it a read and tell me which stories you have enjoyed the most. How to hack like a porn star: a step-by-step -step process for breaking into a bank. This hacking book covers many hacking tactics used by cyber criminals, but also by advanced ethical hackers during an engagement. I liked the fact that it draws different scenarios of attacking a fictitious bank, which greatly increases its content value. In fact, it breaches the perimeter both using a phishing campaign and hacking the external servers. To add even more value, it starts with the tactics you can perform to stay anonymous. When I read this hacking book, I immediately remembered the software story from the Art of Intrusion book I mentioned earlier. Only this time, I'm witnessing the hack in a very technical perspective. Throughout this awesome hacking book, you will get to learn the thinking process of a determined hacker as he or she slowly but surely infiltrates a fictitious bank IT infrastructure. You will also discover the different hacking tools that can be used for each phase of the engagement. If you found this content helpful, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe to this channel so that you get updates whenever I publish a new video on ethical hacking and bug bounty hunting. If you're new to hacking and want to learn the basics, check out the free OWASP Top 10 Theory and Hands-on training on thehackerish.com and apply your knowledge on the lab which supports it. If you enjoy learning with videos, I invite you to watch the OWASP Top 10 YouTube playlist However, I encourage you to first try to solve the lab exercises so that you don't spoil them. Don't forget that there are supporting blog posts for most of the videos you watch on this YouTube channel. I also encourage you to subscribe to the Friday newsletter on thehackerish.com to gain some new hacking knowledge at the end of the week. If you enjoy listening while doing other things at the same time, check out the Hack for Fun and Profit podcast, link in the description box. Until next time, stay curious, keep learning, and go find some bugs.